Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> I am here with my lesbian co-worker, Mrs. Bubblehead. <laughs> oh, Sebastian, how I have... Oh my god, I just said your real name. I thought you were taking your damn photo. Okay, well, this is uh, the studio of what we have here, and so uh, if you want to come just down the hallway a bit. Now, for the new series, I can see... <laughs> what is wrong with you? <laughs> During the first season when we were filming, we had no idea how the show was going to go. A lot of it was just improv. We started filming it off in a small room, in a small studio. And then within the first few months, we realised that this was a series that we were producing. It wasn't just a comedy sketch, like how we originally envisioned it. Um, so by winter, we had completed season one. And that's we were contacted by scene in the headquarters and they encouraged the program. So by the new year, we started on the second season. And five years later, we're now on season four. So yeah, it's been a really tremendous and unexpected journey about how everything panned out. And now that we're back for a new season, it's almost hard to believe that five years ago, we started off like this. I'll always remember those first few days in the studio, just Sebastian and I doing improv. So. I think back then, in the first few months, we actually didn't really know where the show was heading. I mean, whenever I was sitting in the studio by myself, I'd always get some random idea, and we'd quickly get the filming equipment, and we'd turn it into one of the episodes. Started it off as a, as a comedy sketch series, um, but then the whole journalism part of the show began to sort of come out of it. And as things became more serious, it became more of a journalism sketch show. I think, actually, that's why the show worked so well, because... I think the show just sort of evolved by itself, and we both evolved on camera, so it had this really rich style. The show was just um, incredibly popular. There was a lot of media attention on both Sebastian and I during the first season, um, when all the major news networks found out that there were these two funny little kids parodying them. Um, you know, we both got a lot of attention and acclaim for that. But I think one of the few things that neither of us expected was how quickly everything would just change. I mean, for, by the time the show ended in December, we were already working on the second season, which began in February of the new year. So yeah, Seb and I were really, really fortunate to have the show become so popular with everyone. And you know, we both became uh, pretty famous. And another thing that we didn't expect is that from this little show, it actually launched our careers, and we both became very, very, very successful after that. And that led to us starring in both the Zombie Day franchise, and the Child Aiden franchise, and Terms of Steel, and The Killings. So I think both of us pretty soon forgot upon where all this sort of fame started, which was, you know, from this small program that we were very fortunate enough for people to like. And then we, oops, wrong picture. And you know, we've both grown a lot. And it's been five years now since the start of the series. And five years later, here we are. Uh, so yeah, we're both really excited and can't wait for you guys to see it. <laughs> <laughs> Good evening, I'm Lindsay Lohan. And today I'm gonna- <laughs> Good evening, I'm Lindsay Lohan, and this is, um, behind the scenes, as you can see, I'm, uh, yeah, I'm, okay. <laughs> good evening, uh, um, good e good morning. <laughs> good evening. <laughs> Hello, I'm, oh, okay, um, good evening, I'm George Bomb Bomb, and I'm giving, um, a, a cutscene on the CNN series. <laughs> Hi, I'm Lizzy Lohan, um, but my character is playing George Bomb Bomb. And today I'm going to give you a tour of behind the scenes of the CNN series. And um, yeah, I play my I play George Bomb Bomb, um, a drunk. I'm not drunk, by the way. <gasps> Hi, I'm Dominic Hesanakis, co-creator and co-star.
star of the CNN series and the fucking sign has gone out. <laughs> <laughs> Shut Hi, I'm Dominic Kasanakis, co-creator and co-star of the CNN show. Now, um, as you can see, this is the studio that we're going to be using for the new series. So, as you can see, we have the panel, or the desk, where the co-anchors are going to be sitting, reporting. And then, um, we have the sign, the classic CNN sign. Ugh, apparently, um, some of our producers have put the wrong picture in, and there's a cupcake in there. But never mind. Um, and as you can see, over yeah, here, you. Uh, we also have, um... This delightful backdrop, as you can see, because it's changed quite a lot since the pilot when it debuted um, a while ago. So as you can see, we have a new backdrop here. It's a lot smaller than the original one, but we are trying to master it. <laughs> <laughs> come and come, took my baby. Could you eat my Could you then? Uh, Miss Swank, what are you doing? Well, I'm just tweeting. Hello, I'm Hillary. I'm Hillary Swank, and today we have a number one, no idea, <laughs> George Bomb Bomb. <laughs> Where is he? <laughs> Hello, I am. Um, I forgot my name. I'm just... <laughs> Good evening, I'm Hillary Swank. <laughs> Good evening, I'm Hillary Swank. And today we have um a um <laughs> we have a one. Good evening, I'm Hilary Wank, and today we have Lindsay Lohan on the show. Oh wait, wait, what? Oh, the people are gonna suck. Anyway, we have Dominic Astamakis coming on. Yay, on the number one show. <laughs> Wank, and tonight we have Lindsay Lohan coming on. Oh, oh, no, the, my apologies. We have, um, oh, the people are gonna suck. Um, we have Dominic Asmakis on the number one show. Fame or shame, come on on. Thank you. Hurry up! <laughs> <laughs> uh, thank you, Wendy, for having me. I'm like, Hillary! No! I'm Hilary White, and today we have Lindsay Lohan on the show. Oh, no, no, sorry, my apology. We, oh god, the other people are gonna suck. We have Dominic Asimakis coming on. Come on in! Who's Thank on you. fame or shame? Thank you, Wendy, for having me on your failing talk show. <laughs> <laughs> I just started! <laughs> so, yeah, you want to talk to me about the series? Yeah, well, it's actually amazing. <laughs> and uh, Wendy and I used to date, apparently, didn't we? 